Do you also struggle with science denial in your classroom? Yep. Misinformation and denial can be touchy subjects, right? For a long time, we hoped that giving students more information would be enough. Yeah, it's not. I actually have an activity that might help address denial head on, but in a fun and engaging way. I'm listening. Start by having students play the game Cranky Uncle. Cranky Uncle is a science denier who uses common techniques to deny science, and he's pretty cranky. I've seen him online. All denial follows a similar playbook, summarized by the acronym FLICK. Fake experts, logical fallacies, impossible expectations, cherry picking, and conspiracy theories. As you learn the techniques, you earn cranky points and unlock more levels with more techniques. It's entertaining and really eye-opening. I've heard those arguments. I just couldn't pinpoint why they were misleading. When students are ready, they get to be cranky uncle. Have them use the flick techniques to deny a topic of their choosing. And the sillier and more outrageous, the better. Ooh, like gravity is a hoax, or there's no such thing as air. Cats aren't real. Depending on the class, have students role play or make posters, create fake social media posts or videos that feature the arguments from Flick. Well, that makes sense. So by using the techniques to create misleading arguments, they'll be better able to spot those arguments in real life. Exactly. Love it. On a more serious note, it's not enough to know how denial works. We also have to know why we fall for it. We're more likely to deny science that conflicts with important beliefs, values, emotions, and desires. That's why denial is such a touchy subject and why it helps to address it this way. Sorry, what? I'm playing cranky.